Hey there everyone, it's Joe from Ainsley Bullion, ainsleybullion.com.au with your very first special for 2024. Happy New Year to everyone. You are looking at 1966 Australian 50 cent rounds. I'll put a link below to this specific products page. Of course, you can walk into the Brisbane and Melbourne stores and purchase over the counter. They are coming in bags of 50. So you're not buying them individually, bags of 50 right there. And let me tell you the special deal straight away, and then I'll go into the history, because if you're someone who already knows these very well, has a bunch of them already, or you know the history behind them, uh, I'll tell you the special right now. So again, bags of 50, we're knocking $10 off per bag of 50. So getting a $10 discount per bag, again, for the next 24 hours, only until 4 p.m. 4 p.m. Queensland time tomorrow. They do come attached with GST because they are not bullion grade, they're investment bullion grade. They're not pure. Here's the deal, they are 80% pure silver. And they are each, they have around roughly one third of a troy ounce of silver, 0.34 uh, of a troy ounce of silver in each coin. So that's for the people who know what these are. You can go to those links or walk into the Brisbane and Melbourne stores uh, today and until 4 p.m. tomorrow or get them online. And here's a little bit of information for the people who have never seen these before. If you're seeing, seeing a round 50 cent coin and your jaw is dropping wondering what is going on with that, let me give you the quick history. This is a real uh, coin, a real 50 cent coin that was in circulation in 1966. You can see it's just like the other coins in your pocket. Uh, you've got Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II, a very young looking Queen Elizabeth II right there. So it looks like your other coins, Australia, 1966. So in 1966, we moved from pre-decimal currency, uh, shillings, pence, etc. And in 1966, we moved to the decimal currency system. So that's dollars and cents, etc. So we brought out all the other coins, but the 50 cent coin was round and it had silver in it. It had 0.34 of a troy ounce of silver, so around about one third of an ounce of troy silver, and that was 80% pure silver in each coin. Now, what happened in that year, the price of silver uh, went to the point where to produce this 50 cent coin cost more than 50 cent, cost more than its uh, face value right there. So very quickly, the gov government went, uh-oh, it's costing us more to produce these than they're actually worth on their face value. So now we need to uh, stop production of those. So they only did it for a year, and they took them out of circulation and people, uh, rather than handing them in to the government, many people just, and a lot of people, including my grandmother uh, as well, hoarded these and kept them because they realized, you know, silver has been money for thousands of years. Uh, and many people recognized that, you know, these could be worth more in the future. So you probably know some people, your grandmother, your grandfather probably had some. I certainly inherited some from my grandmother, a big bag of them. So many people like to stack them these days for that fractional silver play, the fact that they are one third of a troy ounce of silver, the fact that they're an Australian uh, based coin as well, and the fact that they were uh, real currency back in the day as well, that added, I guess, trust and security uh, as well. And the fact that, you know, silver is real money itself in how our humble opinion, not just currency. So these are very popular amongst uh, silver investors and silver stackers. So as I said, they are in bags of 50, normally $10 more, but for the next 24 hours, $10 off the bag of 50, again, with a GST attached. So that is what you need to know. If you don't have one of these in your stack or a bag of 50 in your stack, uh, it's a great idea, again, a piece of history, but the fact that it is fractional silver, one third of a troy ounce of silver in each coin. That is it. I hope you grab this deal, uh, our very first deal for 2024. Many to come this year, one a week or possibly even more. You never know what could happen. Please like, share and subscribe. Balance your wealth in an unbalanced world. Take care. We'll see you next time.